Hello everyone and welcome to another Nabtech tutorial. Today we're going to quickly and briefly show you how to hide your desktop icons like I have right now. So this might be useful if you have a presentation and you have to publicly show your computer screen on a projector. Um, this will pretty much hide your icons. Now don't worry, this is completely temporary and it's easy to remove or to change. So there is no deletion or anything permanent like that. So it's very simple and it works with all Macs, it's completely free and it also works with the latest version of OS X which is El Capitan. So stick to the end to learn how to hide your desktop icons. Alright, so to hide our desktop icons, we are going to be using a completely free application that you can download from the App Store. And that's what we are going to do right now. So launch the App Store, it's this little A icon down here. Um, it can only also be found in your launch pad. So um, once the App Store is launched, go to the search bar and type in Hidden Me Free. Now this will um, bring up this application right here. The icon might have changed by the time you watch this video, but it should be the same title. Now the application is completely free and it is not a trial version, so it's completely without any limitations. The only thing that you might need to note is that this um, works with one display only. So if you have a multiple display, you have to buy the Pro Edition, which is at an extra cost. Now this won't be a problem if you have only one screen, so it's completely free for you and you can download it from here. So what you're going to do is going to click, you're going to click get and install. Now since I've already installed this application, I have open right here, but yours will be get and install. Once you click install, it will prompt you to enter your Apple ID password, and once you do so, the application will start installing. So once the application has installed, you can launch your launch pad. To find it so either by clicking this rocket icon over here or by clicking F4 on your keyboard and um, the icon will look like this so to launch the application it's fairly simple simply click on it and as you can see no window pops up this is because this is a very simple application um, once you launch the application it will have it will show this little circle right here on your menu bar and once you click the circle it will show you the applications option so it's really as simple as that. You click on this circle in your menu bar, you click show desktop icons to show them. Once you click that, your desktop icons will show again. And once you click here while your icons are shown, this feature will be changed to hide desktop icons. So before you turn on your com before you start projecting your computer, all you have to do is come here, click hide desktop icons, and once you're done and you've um, disconnected the computer from your projector or whatever situation you're in, just simply click here and click show desktop icons again. Now what's nice about this application is that we also get extra features that are not f available in most other um, desktop uh, icons hider applications. So these are launch at login, which um, launches the application at login. So you don't have to go to your launch pad and click on the icon. It will do it for you and the little circle up here will always be there. We also have the hide icons at launch option which is useful if you're doing presentations a lot and if you, um, if you have your computer connected to the projector even before turning it on, which would save you time. So instead of going up here and clicking hide desktop icons, they will be already hidden once you log in and you'll have to click here and click show desktop icons to show them. These uh, down here are some other options for the applications. And once you're done and you've shown your icons again, you can quit the application by clicking here or hitting command quit. So it's as simple as that and it's completely free. Um, it works very it works very smoothly and it's um, a, an alternative. So you don't have to blur anything anymore. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it and if this helped you out, please hit the thumbs up. Um, it really helps us out and it tells us that you want some more videos. Uh, also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It's completely free and it'll, it will keep you up to date on our videos. So if you have any other um, suggestions for tutorials or suggestions for other videos, you can add, that, uh, add those in the comments and we will reply. Thank you very much for watching once again. This has been another NapTech tutorial.